Pedro Munhoz versus Jimmy Rivera is going to happen in uh, January 13th. And gonna be good scrap actually. Pedro Munhoz uh, out of his residence in Torrance, California. He was born in Sao Paulo, Brazil. 65 inches is his reach. 5 foot 6 fighter riding on a score of 18. 5. Won a contest. Well, he had ups and downs in the UFC. He's the former RFA bantamweight champion. He holds notable victories over Matt Hubbard. Russell Doan, Justin Scoggins, Rob Font, Damian Stasia, Greg Jones, Brian Caraway, Cody Garbrandt, very well rounded mixed martial artist who turned the lights out. I still remember this Vivian overhand ride that uh, turned the lights out on Cody Garbrandt. He lost to John Dodson, Aljamai Sterling, Frank Edgar, but these were, these were tight decisions, you know. He also lost to Jimmy Rivera in their first outing uh, five years ago. We have very close split decision, but I believe uh, I believe Pedro Munchos progressed a lot as a fighter. And Jimmy Rivera, unbelievably tough guy, third degree black belt. Kyokushin Kai under Tiger Schulman fighting out of Manhattan, New York, five foot four, but his reach is sixty eight inches, right on score twenty three four. He is the former Cage Fury fighting uh, champion. The former King of the Cage, flyweight uh, champion, the former Ring of Combat bantamweight champion. He lost to Petr Jan, Aljamain Sterling, and Marlon Moraes in the last five outings, but outworked Cody Stamon, John Dodson. He also outworked Almeida, Faber, Alcantara. Marco, he knocked uh, out Marcus Brimich. In the first outing, he won Pedro Munchos, but this was a very, very controversial victory because fighters were very very close it was a super close fight and uh, i got to say that uh, this guy also competed at the uf bisping versus miller where he was tko'd by dennis bermudez and uh, jimmy rivera is very very good in the stand-up on the ground he's fair i mean i can say that pedro munchus should be better on the ground because of uh, because of his uh, legitimate bg black belt so i don't see I don't see Rivera finishing via submission. I don't see Rivera out wrestling uh, Pedro Munchos too, because even if he drags him to the ground, Munchos is definitely going to defend takedown attempts. Munchos might submit, uh, might submit Rivera, but that's hardly going to happen because Rivera is very, very good uh, with uh, with stop with uh, defense in the takedown. It's very hard to finish him when it comes to strikes. Pedro Munchos, he has very, very good strikes at the moment. Looking back at the current shape, yeah, when it comes to clinching, slight advantage to Munchos. But if we take a look at the current shape, you know, I can say that uh, this is going to be a very, very hard battle. Stamina, it's kind of maybe very, very slight advantage to Jimmy Rivera or the same grade. Listen, Jimmy Rivera won for the first time. But this time, I think it's very hard to defeat uh, Munchos two times in a row. There's no guy who defeated Pedro Munchos, which uh, you can see too. But uh, yeah, uh, all right, Jared Sanders. Munchos, uh, Munchos uh, result was overturned once earlier, but I don't think it's going to happen. I'm going to say that Pedro Munchos wins this one. Jimmy Rivera won their first outing. Now I'm rooting for Munchos. Definitely think Munchos is going to win.